Hello everybody, this is Jack, and let me know if you see my screen. We're getting ready for another training. Uh, <laughs> there is that you, you are late. Already have one. <laughs> dot dot dot. Hi Terry. I I know you're <laughs> that you are. Hi Aline, Brian, Gail, Perry. Hi. So. Uh, this will be exciting, I know. So, um, I kind of want you, um, I'm looking for the wow effect uh, that you will have in an hour. So I have to build it up a little bit. Are, are you okay with that? Huh? And um, because then you understand, um, understand what you will get. Okay. Uh, Rodney said, we, you know, leader in local markets in 2009 screen is showing good. Okay. Now let's get to work. Let's put together a list. Okay. What you expect from the website, the, you know, the content, which, what are the elements? What are the elements? of a website okay i'm speaking about the the, the website huh? Huh? Well, but, 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 uh, domain yeah domain not looking for that but i will put it down now it's uh you will get the domain at some point probably uh call to action okay call to action okay uh, the team, yeah, I need something more than the team. Mobile friendly, mobile friendly, yeah. And then fast loading homepage, yeah. I'm looking for more the content. Contact information. Okay. Images, so images, okay. Images section, Im that's the images section. Correct. That that makes sense. Uh, accept payments. Okay. Videos. Map. Content uh, offering product uh, about us. Okay. Blog. Menu. Services. Contact us. Contact us. I think we have video. Yeah. Schema. Yeah, to rank high. Yeah. S images. Where do we have fast loading? Schema. What sells about hours, phone, contact info, logo, chat. Uh, ADA, social proof, okay, the store, the online store, okay, link to social media, link to social media service offered yeah side map yeah anything else testimonials Chatbot, texting, yeah, it's all the same. Texting. Texting is, uh, there's call to action for call this number, correct, Billy? It's not really a website thing, it's more call to action. SSL, okay, domain, SSL. Anything else? 
legal and political. Okay, so terms. Voicemail. Uh, I'm not sure uh, the call to action voicemail. Privacy, yeah. Chatbot, we have that already. Okay, anything else? Privacy policy, yeah, yeah. That, those are the terms, eh? Privacy. Okay. Okay, good. So we have a nice list. Let me save this. Okay. So we'll content. Yeah, content. We said that. Content. And then the phone number, huh? Phone number, as a mass number, etc. Huh? Copyright, yeah. Text, copyright. Okay. In oh yeah, yeah. Oh the form. Yeah, we said that. So the form, huh? Appointment booker. Booker. That can be a link. Call tracking, yeah. Uh, where did we have that phone number? Okay, are we done? What? Okay. So, let me let me do this in two parts. I love this. You will see the result. This will. I think we have the logo. Um, this will get clear in a second. Okay. First, we have to discuss. Another topic. Okay, when are you going to use a website? And when are you going to use a landing page? Eh? When are you going to use a website? And when are you going to use a landing page? So what's the difference? A website has, a, so if you don't know, a top menu with several pages, correct? And a landing page, one page. One page can be part of a funnel, correct? A uh, website is basically your business home, yes. So do we agree that website is more for branding, branding and and multiple multiple services? Correct? Uh, if I can spell it right. And the landing page is more for selling a particular service or service or product. We agree on this? Good. So a website is more for local business, correct? They need a website, they need an about us, they need to contact us, they need all those things in place, huh? They they kind of want to build up the reputation. Not all need to sell one product or one service, agree? But if you send paid traffic, paid traffic, huh? Okay, that is more, is often, often targeted, 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 traffic, targeted, targeted, traffic, okay? Then, you probably want to send it to the landing page. Agree? Okay. 
So let's for so I will cover ball. So let's let's first cover uh, website. I mean, let's first cover website, and then I will cover landing page. Are you cool with that? Okay. So web. So in today's training, you're going to learn both the website and the landing page. Okay. So you log in your Rapify account, you go to Natures, okay? Tell me a niche, okay? So I don't tell me a niche, okay? You can do any niche, but you can do view, view, okay? And then say, wow, I love this. I love this dynamic page, how it looks like. It's good for my brand. Accounting is actually a good niche, okay? So I going to use it. Okay, going to use it, and I going to use that as um, my starting point. Correct? Has a nice slider. Okay, nice background image that you can change. Okay, has all those serves accounting tax audits. Okay, happy client form. What do you guys think? Is this something you like? This website? We have those in 280 version. Huh? 280. Okay. This, you don't need to feel the pain anymore to create a website, okay? Just select one of those 280. And if the niche is not exactly your niche, okay? Just get one and add things, okay? The audits, they all look good, huh? They all look very professional. Everybody uh, with a reasonable budget is good with it, okay? If they want special, they can pay for it, but for let's say $1,000 or $2,000, they will be happy to pay for it. This website is significant better than 90% of the websites what local business have. Significant with the loading, with the speed, with the mobile responsive, with everything. Okay? And then you make the changes, you go to site settings, you go company details, okay? You just enter the new information. And so, uh, and more or less, you're done. You you publish it, okay? And then uh, you, you can click on the link if you want. You can add links. You, so it's all very handy, okay? You, you see here those uh, menu. You click on it and go to the menu, and now you can add it to menu. This is like WordPress, okay? You can add it. You can add this to your like very, very easily. Any question about websites? Not ask me and ask me anything to edit or show or whatever. Huh? You guys like this website? You can even do uh, site settings and social reviews, the blog, language setting, business hours. You can set any page as home page. You can do style wizards for if they if you want other colors, huh? What niches do you have? We have 280 niches, almost any niche we have. 280 niches, the most common niches we have. Uh, how to add the video? Let's say, uh, let's say we want a video under this black banner, correct? Okay, let's do, uh, let's do sections and we do a grid, okay? And we add that grid. Okay, and we move it a little bit down. Okay, I think I need to save it first. So that is accountant, accountant demo. Okay, save it now. Move it a little bit down. Okay, I, I want it below that black. Uh, I, I, it can also be above, that would also not be bad, but not do here. Then you click add element, and from here, I can add any element like video, okay? Now the video is in it, okay? You click on the gear button, okay? If you have uh, the video uh, boss, you can just get the video URL, uh, video here, or, and if you don't have videos, you enter the URL, huh? This is all in Rapify, yes. Yeah, I know, Rapify has evolved a lot. So here you can add the video very in two seconds. Now three seconds then. Hmm? So 
Rapid Fire websites are HTML that has advantages, but it also has disadvantages. Okay, so the disadvantage is all your WordPress plugin will not work. It's not WordPress based. The advantage is it's very it it's you, they cannot hack it. Okay, they cannot hack it. The sites are not WordPress based. It's all HTML. So the advantage is load super fast. Looked very good, not hack sensitive, easy to edit. Okay, if you are not technical skilled, Rapify is the way to go. If you are very handy and you have a lot of plugins and you you are very good in WordPress, then you use local team jack with WordPress. Okay, you have the option. We have, we have, for every one of you guys, we have a solution. Make sense? Anything else you want to see on the website? Can it be hosted on Rapify with a dire direct? Yes. You just let me save it, okay? You just order the domain name, and either you post it on the domain name, okay? Here's the hosting. You order you. You can link your existing domain name. You can buy in the domain name, okay? And once the domain is propagated, you can just um, Host it to uh, publish to it, and you can also do subdirectory, uh, subdomain, and a directory. Okay. Are all web landing pages ADI compliant? Yes, you can enable ADA. Okay. So that is just a setting. Okay. Size settings. ADA. And now you click yes. Okay. And now ADA is enabled. And when it gets published, it will show that icon. You can publish the site. You can download the website and upload to your to your site. Okay. You can also publish um, when you say publish. Okay. Let me publish it. You can do it on a Rapify server. You can do the home. Day. You can enter your seat panel information, you can uh, update your FTP information, and you can enter the P gateway. Make sense? That are all the options. Make sense? So you have the options where you want to host it. Can a calendar be integrated in these webs? But what you do is you yeah, we have a product for that. Some of you guys grabbed it, uh, Biz Calendar. Okay. Let me go log into it. See if I can grab a link. Okay. Okay, you go to services. Okay, you grab uh, the booking link. Okay. You grab you grab this link. You go, go back to the... Uh, website and then you do a call to action okay um so let's say you want here a button okay add the button okay and then you enter the link okay there is a link okay and then let's say apply changes okay and then book now Okay. Okay. Now here you have your okay, and then you want to open the new tab, probably. Uh, open site. Open the same tab. Open the new tab. Apply change. Now when now when uh, when somebody clicks on it, they take you to the calendar. Can you remove or move the about us box? Where is the about us box? Where is that? Here this. Yeah, you, if you don't want this, okay, you edit the slider. Okay, you click on it, okay. See here, edit the slider, okay. And then you go to the slider settings, okay, about us. And then what did you wear? Uh, uh, new title, okay. Save it. 
You can you can make any changes, huh? Save. Okay, back to the side. You see a new title? Okay. And you can just, if you don't like the top slider, okay, you just delete it all together. Hmm? Just delete this section and you add an image, a video, whatever you want in the top section. So make sense, Rio? Do you feel confident you can create a website for many niches with Rapify? Do you feel confident? Okay. But that's actually, actually not the only part I want to demo to you. <laughs> I have something more. I know you guys know this and it improves all the time. And we, you see, we uh, put those dynamic elements in it. huh? You see, there was also new and the designs are new and the functionality is new. huh? all we keep improving all the time huh? all the time you see those dynamic elements is new huh? and they look better and uh, it, it, it's better and more responsive all the time we we uh, improve but that is not the thing i wanted to demo because you kind of expect this but wolf you guys want to create a landing page a funnel a page what convert one service one product maybe you know whatever for yourself or for for anybody else that it will really gear to conversions instead of branding huh so this part, what we what we just discussed about it, huh? Landing page, pay traffic, huh? Who wants to create this in, let's say, shall we do, who wants to create this in 10 minutes? Or what did I say in the email? In seven minutes, I think I said in email, huh? For, for targeted traffic, for paid traffic, for Google ads, for everything, huh? For Facebook. For, for YouTube, you sign up to a page and you going to work towards the conversion. Okay. But seven minutes, yeah. Now let me go back. So let's let's go only so the content. So let's filter only the content, but not that they load fast and all the things, okay? So we need only the content element because the load fast, all the websites are Rapify, they load fast, okay? They are mobile friendly, okay? That is that is just a given, okay? It, it goes about the content for the, except for the map about us, we don't need about, we can do about us, okay? We don't need the blog because the landing page, okay? We don't need the menu, but we can. Okay, let's add menu back, but that is not really what we want in landing page. Okay, contact schema. Okay, chatbot is just a plugin. ADA is just a setting. Okay, social proof. Online store is a link. Okay, link to social media site. Map. Okay, it's just we don't need to touch more terms. This is just a footer link. The content phone number. Okay, yeah, we can do the form. The point is a link. So, kind of this is the part for landing page, correct? You guys see what I see now? It is just 10 to 15 groups of website content. Do you agree with this? Do you agree that a website is built on 10 to 15 different sections? Do you guys see this? Do you, do you guys see this, what I saw okay, a while ago? Do you agree that a website is uh, consists of 15, let's say 15, I don't know, give the number, huh? 
section, different section, different. You guys agree on this? Yeah, you can say blocks, huh? categories. Okay, categories. Let's say categories then, okay? Make, maybe make that sense, huh? Cato categories. Okay? So, elements, yeah. Now, what, what if you had 10 choices of each category to build your website? Okay, so from we, 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 we define those categories and within each categories, we give you 10 different videos, we accept payment images, all different blocks, but related to that category. And you just choose to, to your like which, which element, which section you like, and you build your landing page. Does it make sense what I'm saying? Everybody can follow me. So I built a library for you, a library from 15 different categories and each category, okay, each category, okay, each category has a library of different elements, okay? And that is how you can create the landing page. Now, I have to be honest with you, okay? It just got uh, kind of in beta testing today and it got launched this weekend, okay? The launch is this weekend, but I, I couldn't wait to demo it to you. I really couldn't wait. It's too good to hold back. It's really too good. I never, never have seen. It is always my dream. It's always my dream, okay? How a, how a landing page builder should work, okay? I have this idea for a long time, but it takes so freaking long time to build such thing, okay? It's not easy. It's really hard. But you will like the end result, and that is what, that, what, uh, what counts for you, correct? So let me log in in the right... Uh... Okay? Let me log in here. I hope this works. Okay. <laughs> okay. I start with a new site. New site. Okay. Now, here comes the magic. Here comes the magic. It's blank. Everybody agree that it's blank? Okay. I click on sections. Sections. Wow. What do you guys see? The grid, the most used. Headers, banners, checkout pages, content form, free as ask questions, features, photos, headings, images, people, portfolio, pricing table, timer, dividers, section, serves and text, video. Huh? What do you guys see? Every category has choices to build your uh, website. Okay? So how are we building the website? Let's say I start with the top, correct? Headers. I choose and head up to my like. Okay, I, I view it. Okay, let me preview it. You guys like it? I don't need the top menu. Okay, I don't want the top menu. See here. Okay, something is happening. <laughs> oh, okay, I like it. Okay, I click on the plus sign. And wow, here on the right side, I'm building my landing page. You guys get it? Here, you know, I have a banner. No, I don't need a banner with it. I can, but I, I feel uh, I don't need it. I need checkout pages. It's for the payment. I will do that at the end. Okay. Contact forms, I will do a bit later. Previous ask question, I will do a bit later. Now I'm going to probably do the headings. Okay. I want a call to action and see which call to action I like at this point. Now let's see. Do the view here. Okay. Click here to add. Okay. This is kind of a nice call to action. So I drag this here, okay? And now I'm now I'm building, I have my second section. Now I have here the call to action. I'll probably go to the features page, okay? Where we have that, uh, features here, okay? 
and then I'm telling about the uh, the product. Okay, let me preview. Okay, the idea looks good. So now I add the features. Okay, so I'm building my website. Now after the features, I might do some images. Okay, images, uh, images. Let's do this. Okay. I do the preview. It doesn't matter which image, I can always replace the images. Okay, I do the, I just drag them here. Okay, drag them here. Move this. I put it, and I will put it in the right place. Now, then I want to do a timer because the landing page. Okay, I do the preview. Yes, I like this. Okay. And then I do the plus sign. And then I do pricing tables. Okay, I want to tell about the pricing, probably two options. Okay. Let me save this. And then I probably want to do a footer. Okay, a footer. I don't need the map. Okay, for landing page. Uh, let's see what this is. Okay. I can have here the links, but I don't need the links. So probably I will do this. Okay. And I don't need the menu. I don't really don't need the menu. So let's see. Um probably a call to action then. I can do the I can do the, the footer, but I, I kind of like a call to action better at the end. So do the headings. Okay, and then um, book a meeting, correct? So let me edit this, okay? And then save, oh, I need to add and save, and then landing page, landing page, page, okay? Save now. Okay, let me close this, and here's my website, so let me drag this, see this section here? Let me drag this to the right spot. Okay, a little bit higher. Good. Kind of like this, a little bit higher. Okay, here. A nice image. Then I probably want the timer below the pricing table. Okay, I drag this. Okay, pricing table. Save this. And then I want this in the footer as a call to action. Okay. For the call to action. Okay, here's my website. What do you guys think? And here I can just click on the image and replace the image. Okay, I can click on the content. Okay, and update the content. But your structure, the structure of your website, your landing page is ready. Huh? And over time, every day, actually every day, okay, we will add more elements. We keep adding elements all the time, okay? Now, now you see here, we have show more, okay? You show more. And then we can show them that in, instead of 10, we show 15 or 20, okay? Does it have a pay button? You can add a pay button, and you can even add checkout pages, okay? So let's add checkout pages. One second. Uh, check out pages, check out pages here. This is new, okay. This is new. Uh, this is really better, but let me add it. So, let me view, let me view it, let me view it for you. This will have the ordering, okay. PayPal, check credit card, email. See, you can add it. This is new, it's not, uh, I haven't done training about that, but you can. Make sense. So this will get launched coming weekend. I love it, said Brian. Huh? Can I get, did you ever have seen such easy uh, landing page builder? The, the landing page can be in the second page, yes. So you can also add another page, okay? And as Arlene is saying that, okay? Check out, check out, okay, check out. Okay, and then in the checkout page, okay, you go to the sections, I go to the 
checkout page. Okay, and now I'm adding it to the checkout page. Okay, you can add an, a header to it for the call to action. Okay, I want to have the header. Okay, I want the call to action. Okay, headers here. And let's do a call to action. I, I'm not headings. Okay, I want this here. Let's do view. Click here to add it. Okay. And uh, uh, here, let me add this, okay. Click here to add it and then save. Okay, and then close this. So that means, okay, check out. Just add it here. Check out. Okay. Save this. Now, when somebody clicks on a buy button or so here, okay, here, you can link them to the checkout page. Huh? Checkout page one, check about page two. Makes sense? I, I think I didn't make, I didn't uh, check out one. Okay, save. Okay, let me clone this. Okay, and I do this checkout number two. Okay. Now, when you go to the home page, huh? You link it to this page number one, and and this you link it to page number two. Okay, that needs to be on a dedicated URL. You don't want to be. Uh, this is just a landing page, huh? Let's say it is an electrician and you are just looking for an appointment with, with info on service. So then, if you're only just looking for an appointment, you use the this. Huh? That is the appointment. Huh? So you don't need the checkout page. You just need the link from the calendar. You put that calendar link on your website. So what this is, is, okay, this is landing page, okay? Geared for conversion, okay? You have the elements, you update the text, and you're done. And Brian said, could you add this to a client's Rapify website as a sub -win? Yes. So if you drive traffic to a client website, you can add this as a subdomain or yeah, or a directory. You can do Brian. But why would you do that? Uh, you can. I see big companies sometimes do big companies, but the domain is only ten dollar a year, so I would not do it for ten dollar to save ten dollar. And that's. But you can. Yeah, that is. That is big. That is always how you wanted to create a website for yourself for uh, to to offer a particular server service do you have to put all the landing page uh, on the subdomain no you just order a new domain for a particular website you can you can't put it on the subdomain you can't put it on directory okay but you have to imagine you you pay all that money for your seo for your paid traffic whatever you do all the effort, and then you just want to put it on the subdomain. You can, but it, it's not where the money is. What is the main reason a business owner will use a landing page? Paid traffic. Paid traffic. Google Ads, Facebook, YouTube, okay? Paid traffic. If you so the website is for branding, the landing page is for conversion. How do we build trust factor with the potential client? It's uh, you uh, you do you add testimonials to it. Okay, you add the testimonials to it. It's same thing. Okay, same thing. Testimony video, testimonials.
it's all the same. So, um, you know this, every Google sent you to a landing page, correct? They don't send you to a website, they send you to a landing page. They want you to take one action by one product and one or service. Okay. Why are they doing it? Because that converts the best. Now, if you're really, really want to scale it, okay, you do uh, front end upsell, huh? So you can create in the same domain name, you can create the next landing page. Huh? So once they check out, okay, instead of they going to get to the product, you send them to an upsell. You not only can get this, but you also can add this, correct? Or you offer a related service. So if somebody buys Google My Business, they also need Google Ads or SEO or a website or whatever. Huh? You can get them through the funnel. Is video boss a section? Yes, video boss is just a video, and you just can uh, add the the link from video boss, from the video from the video boss. So the upsell page is another landing page, correct? But you can do, let's say, add another page. Okay, you give the name. Okay, and then upsell. Okay, upsell. You don't call it upsell, but I will damn it as an upsell, okay? You build your website, and once they are done with the checkout page, okay, once they pay the redirect the redirect URL, okay, is the upsell, okay? This is all built in Rapify, yes. It's all mobile responsive. Hopefully, by a panel of etc., and then the appointment booking. Yes, pretty slick. You feel the wow effect, huh? You feel okay. They was worth to uh, join the training. <laughs> this is this is magic. This is magic. How this works? You can scroll here. Okay, you can scroll here. Okay, you can preview them. Okay, see if you like. You can add them. You can drag them. Okay, you can just build the landing page. And even if the landing page exists, you can just add them at any time. Okay, server side services. Okay, services here. Okay. Then you look which service you like, okay? You preview them, okay? Okay, so let's say I like them, okay? And now let me add the services here, okay? I drag them to the spot I like. Save them. Close this. Okay, I go to the server side section, and I'm going to update my images, the text, and, you know, if you want to read more or not. Okay, you can also uh, delete the button and go direct to the sign up. Huh? Can you show us how you will build the service? Yes. You see how this works? Simple, correct? Can they select the service and then sign up? Yeah. You can also do read more and then you go to the checkout page, correct? You link this button to the checkout page. Make sense? So you just create different uh, checkout pages and link them to the button. It's kind of your imagination how you build the landing page. The biggest, the biggest, the biggest new things is this, is this screen. This screen will change everything. Okay, this screen will change everything. It's easy to select the section to your like, okay? You preview them and you add them to your landing page. That is the biggest thing. And then the handling, the handling is all in Rapify. Okay. 
multiple pages, check out pages. Uh -huh. So there's no, it's kind of all visual. It's no technical, technical challenge anymore. Make sense? Who have seen this before? Search an easy landing page build. I, I damn it to Brian and he never saw search Kuz interface. He, he said, I never have seen such thing. So, Gail is asked, how much would you charge to build a landing page? Now, when you, when an internet marketer need a landing page built, okay, I don't think you get it on a thousand dollar nowadays. Okay. Brian said it is so fast and you don't have to save it. Yeah. And all the handling, you see, see here the landing page. Let's say you like the landing page. It's really your favorite, huh? You're really your favorite. And you want to I want to use over and over again. You know what you do? You clone it, okay? And that is your new starting point. Make sense? So landing page number two, okay? You have your starting point. So you can just create a nice landing page and use it over and over again. Huh? You just update the text, you update the links, you make small changes, okay? And then you will see when I go to my sites, oh, I have the original and I have the clone. You see? And Brian said, you just make my workload so much easier. So if you have local team Jack and then you want uh, the checkout page, yes, the checkout, you can also, you can also create only the landing page with the checkout pages. Okay. So that you only do the checkout pages and that becomes your buy link. Make sense? So the niche comes with images, the landing pages, they just, I don't have a library of thousands of thousand images and you always uh, look for something else and I don't want they look all the same. Hmm? So. What do you guys think? Never been so easy to create a landing page? I bet, correct? Never been so easy. It's all visual. It's new. We're building up the library with more sections all the time, every day. Huh? Every day we build up new sections. Mobile responsive, easy to use. Gail said, this is the best creation product I have seen. Yeah. This is, this is the best um, landing page I know exists. Landing page builder. I, and I, I'm pretty honest in that. So, do the landing page each need their own domain? They don't need. You can, you can just publish on a subdomain or on directory. Same as everything works in Rapid, okay? Ah, Terry switched from beer to champagne, yes. Ah, it's time to see that we celebrate something. Okay, which autoresponder, okay? The most common, okay? I go to settings and then uh, I have to go here. Let me log here in. Amm user, okay, and then settings, uh, integrations, okay, duplicate Sand Eagle, Instant Reply, Google Map, Google Capture, Inf FusionSoft, GoToWebinar, AWeber, Content Content, CatResponse, iContact, MailChimp, and Zapier. 
So basically any because it works with Zapier. Huh? And every autosponder should work with Zapier. Quinn said we could use we could use just the landing page buy pages for our clients, product and sell those to them as an add-on. Yes, you can. Okay, and you can do the store, you can do the blog page, okay. There's so much opportunities that there's whatever the client needs and wants related to websites, Rapify should be able to do that on a very easy way. And the beauty from website is that they will not leave you. They always need small updates and they 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 kind of they although it is digital, they feel they get some physical stuff. Huh? So they are very happy with it. And you don't need to tell how you create it, huh? They think you are coding it, huh? No, you just use a landing page builder. Okay, so you create a new site. Okay, it's empty. Go to sections. Oh, no, sorry. No, this is the, this is, uh, the current, this is the live version, okay? What is getting released, what getting launched on Monday, okay? Is this. Oh, I'm, on Saturday, I mean this weekend, okay? Go to sections, and this is new. This is really new. You go people, portfolio, pricing tables, timer, dividers, all kind of sections, services, text, video. Okay? They are kind of ABC ordered, so not the position of the landing page, so you can easily find them. Is this the new version automatically Rapify? Yes, this is web-based and always get automatically updated when there's a new one. You don't need to click on the update. Gary, hi Gary, you love this, correct? For your Google Ads uh, sites. This is the perfect builder for Google Ads. Okay, whenever you see something, um, but you think, you know, is a niche for Google Ads, and you can, what you can do is you can put some energy in it, okay, and build a nice garage door landing page, a nice roof landing page, or a nice plumber, and you just use them over and over again, you clone them, huh? you just clone them, you use, you have one framework, and you, and then you go to the next client, and the next client, and the next client, and just, and just uh, update some information, okay? Make sense? Gary, do you see this? How you can scale this? Yes, I have. Uh, now, what you, if you want really? Okay, any niche. If you say um, I need IDs for a, a good landing page, okay. You go. Let's say. Uh, Roofer, roofer, uh, big city, huh? Orlando. Okay. Now, those ads are $25. Okay. They are $25. Okay. 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 Here you will get IDs for a good landing page. Okay. Anthony and it. Okay. Ah, they do uh, answer the zip now. <laughs> You see, they they go directly to form, okay? Images. So this this you can create in the Rapify landing page builder, okay? You do the form on the top. Wow! Immediately call to action, okay? And this is Home Advisor. Uh, big companies. Okay, I want just from a not from a business directory. Here, header, contact us, okay, image, 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 tags, testimonial, here, somebody asked for how do you get the trust, you show the testimonials, image, 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 contact us. I even don't like how the contact us form, because it should be white in the background, okay, 
But yeah, had a image text image. You can add testimonials. You see testimonials, somebody asked for it. Okay. You just build this in Rapify Builder, something like this, very easily. Just get landing page which you like and you kind of use it and see if IDs for, um, for your own landing page. Yeah, I will add some default at some point, Dave. I know you guys are always looking for uh, examples and you, you you can just edit them. Yeah. But I think the landing page builder already give you a head start, huh? Good. Who wants to try it out this weekend? Who wants to build a landing page this weekend? Gary asks, do you have a kind of default landing page template which includes the most common section ready for editing? Yeah, you know, Gary, what I could do is uh, a typical landing page where you just uh, change the content as a default. I can do that. Roger said, yes, Quincy, absolutely. Burger said, yes. And Gare said, I think we would all appreciate that. And Thomas said, yeah. So I will do an, a special um, this weekend. Uh, it will get launched this weekend. Um, give me some time to prepare it. It is all new and needs to uh, uh, get launched. And then uh, let me know, okay? Let me know uh, how you like it. I think that is that is that is just all visual. You don't need any technical skill. You. You just click on new site or I will probably create some examples, okay? And then you click on sections, okay? And you build your website. They will preview on the right and you save it and you publish it. Good. And with that, I thank everybody for your time and looking for our uh, mastermind the next week, Tuesday. Thank you so much. Thanks, Quincy. Thanks, Julian. Thanks, John. Thanks, Rodney. Thanks, Brian. Burgers, Bill. Dave. Okay, I will run a, a, a special uh, cloud this weekend. Gail, Barb, thank you so much.